Howdy folks, Doc here with Last Best Tool, and I've got another quick unboxing. I started to open it because I didn't think it would really matter that much, but then I'll show you what happened. Uh, first of all, this is how the box arrived, kind of messed up. I did cut a label off, but you can see it uh, shipped from uh, Sesame Street in Illinois. Um, but anyway, inside looked like this. Well, looks exactly like this because that's as far as I got. Um, little Ziploc bag with unfinished some paracord in there. But then there was this. Look at that packing job. It's kind of in waxed paper. Brown paper that feels a little slippery there. And two knots. Unusual, huh? Looks like uh, looking at the bow top tied that way and then tied that way. But anyway, I thought I'd open it in front of you and show you what we're in for here. I have not opened this thing. I've not gotten a package like this in a long time. I used to get stuff like that from Japan. But anyway, so here it is. Um, as you know, I like EDC tools, and this one caught my eye. It took me a moment to realize just how big it is. Big it yeah, that's like, that's wax, some kind of wax paper. But anyway, there it is. Look at that. This is a Warrenson Titanium Pry Bar. And the uh, idea behind the paracord is that you can use these holes and put a paracord handle on it if you want. Um, look at the finish work on that. Those are tool marks, but they're actually so even that they're kind of nice. Nice sharp corners. Um, you could open boxes probably, slice open things, but it's not sharp like you could cut something. Um, it's titanium, real thick. I like titanium pry bars, and most of them, you know, when, that you see are tiny. And then when I saw this guy, I thought, that's like half a lawnmower blade. That is great. And it's thick enough that it actually really is a titanium, I mean, it really is a pry bar you get that in something. I mean, there's a lot of force, and titanium's pretty springy. Looks like there's a, it's a wedge shape. Um, obviously, it's asymmetrical, except the peak right down there of the blade is centered right through. So that would be more knife-like rather than chisel-like. And then a big flat chisel there for prying, wedging under things. Of course, you could strike back there. Um, you'd probably get a fire starter going with that. I think that's sharp enough on the edge. It's not super sharp, but this this would probably, I don't know, that's not that sharp. Lightweight for, you know, it's a piece of titanium. I may throw a, uh, a handle on it just to try it, but not green. I'm going to have more fun with the color. Um, but it's a EDC tool, and I love EDC tools. I'm going to be doing more with EDC stuff. Some people think it's crazy. I just enjoy these objects, enjoy carrying them, enjoy finding uses for them. Um, and this is by far the best EDC pry bar. A lot of them, you know, are, are little, little things, um, little pry bars, little odds and ends. Uh, this is one of my favorites here. This little shrade, I think, is who marketed that. Tiny, got a lot of things, but you can't really pry much with it. Go even smaller. Here's a 511. Teeny weeny one. They're great for prying bottle caps open. Um, and I don't, as, as great as it sounds, trying to use these uh, wrenches that are built into them. Um, a little night eyes pry bar. Um, but the problem with these little ones is you have to have the wrench flush, and then your entire lever arm is one half you know, the size of the wrench or less to try to wedge that into something. Um, so I don't want a wrench. I've got a wrench. I want a solid pry bar. Um, and I was almost tempted to cut open one of my snap-on striking ch or striking chisels, striking scrapers, that's what they are, and just getting the metal shaft out of it. I still may do that, cut the handle off one and see. But I wanted titanium. Anyway, there it is. There's a link below. There's 70 bucks, or it was 70 bucks, and it took weeks before it arrived. I don't know where it shipped from, um, but maybe they, they hand make them or something when you order one. I don't know. Uh, but pretty nice. See how it goes. There it is. With that, Doc out.